YouTube, what's going on? It's John John, and I'm back again with another video today. It's been a minute, but I'm back today to do a Q&A video today on my channel. Reason I'm doing a Q&A video is because I feel like this is kind of, every time I do those pauses on YouTube where I don't upload a video for like a month or so, I feel like I have to kind of like start over, but not really start over. So this is my reintroduction back into the flow of things, you feel me? And I'm also doing this for the purpose of the new subscribers that I've gained on my channel. Welcome to you guys to give you guys a sense of who I am because I figure people on my channel kind of really don't know who I am or where I came from or what I do. So I'm gonna jump right in with the questions. I asked a couple questions on Instagram, Twitter, and I think a few on YouTube. I got a couple of responses on there as well. So I got a couple questions here. Let's get it to them. First question, who the fuck are you? John John. John John Vlogs here on YouTube, Instagram. I'm a vlogger, I'm an artist, I make music. Overall, I would just say just content creator as a whole. I don't really have one box on myself. I do vlogs surrounding my schooling. I go to Kennesaw State University, that's another thing. So I usually do my vlogs surrounding my experiences out here and give incoming students some type of uh, advice or tips coming into the school year, I guess so. Overall, content creator, music, YouTube, anything man follow me on instagram if you want to see more next question how long have you been doing youtube believe it or not i've been doing youtube for about 10 years now i was doing youtube way early in my life i'm talking about too early to the point i wish i kind of didn't do it because now i still got some cringy videos that i probably forever be out there on the internet i think i started my uploading my first youtube video in 2009 it was me and my sister, we were big fans of iCarly, so we wanted to do like a web show, game show type thing. Hi, this is Funny Videos, the funny show in the world. So I filmed it on an iPod Nano, and we threw that thing up. Looking back, those I got a, probably a good handful of those videos that are out on channels that I forgot the password to type thing, so. But yeah, 10 years, that's, that's a long time, so go ahead and subscribe to me right now because I'm gonna keep doing it in my 20th year, 30th year, and 40th year. Don't care. Next question, and shout out to my homie who asked this. How can I make money as a broke college student? And you are in luck, my G, because I actually have a whole video on this right here. And I think I actually titled it How to Make Money as a Broke College Student type thing. It's right there. It's what I do. There's plenty of different options, but I, for me, just as a college student in the area I'm in, I find doing Postmates and DoorDash and things that I can kind of do on my own time to generate a little extra money as the most easiest things, I guess, to do. When I say easiest, I mean easiest to work around my college schedule and maybe work around like a work schedule if anybody goes, goes to work or has like another outside of job. So Postmates, DoorDash, if you wanna watch that video, it's gonna be right there, it's gonna be in the description. I also have a video, I think like how to save money as a college student as well. You should go check that out as well. Two good videos for all my students at Kennesaw or at anywhere that are looking to get some extra bread. Next question, what type of camera setup do you use? For one, I can show you because I'm actually revamping my whole setup right now. Here's my camera setup right here. As you guys can see, I got two umbrellas blaring on me right here. This is A5000. I love it. It shoots a crystal picture that you guys can see right there. I actually usually uh, shoot my videos on that DSLR right there. That's a Canon T5i. That's what I usually used to shoot on, but ever since she's had this, I need one of these. But stay tuned because I actually just ordered something right there. So I have a new vlogging camera that we're going to try to try out. So a whole new vlogging setup right there. So stay tuned for that. As you guys know, I just moved into my apartment. So I'm just shooting this in the corner of my room. Next question, Xbox or PS4? I'm on PS4. I had an Xbox, but I sold my Xbox because my girl bought me the PS4. So I didn't need both. But I'm actually getting another Xbox back again because I gotta have both because now I have my own spot. So I need the PS4 in this room, the Xbox in that room to keep it gangster like that. What are you studying in school? I am a marketing major here at KSU. I will be going for my four year bachelor degree in marketing. I will not be doing any additional years, hopefully. Hopefully we can finish this thing out in four years. I'm on my third. So we got one and a half more. One and a half more, wow. One, half, one, half, okay. Predictions on the Super Bowl and how is your fantasy team doing this year? I got Eagles Chiefs in the Super Bowl, straight up. I'm saying it right now. Chiefs gonna get over that hump in the AFC and get off on the Patriots. 
Eagles going again. We were supposed to three-peat. We were supposed to win last year. We won the year before. We're going to win it this year. That's all right. We're going to win two times in the past three years. Eagles Chiefs Super Bowl. As far as my fantasy team, they're all fucking trash. If you see your name on this list, you're a scrub because I lost to a dude last week with four guys out. Next question. I'm coming to KSU next semester. Where would you... Well, I don't know. Where would you... Where would you recommend staying on campus? I don't know if they're trying to say where would you recommend staying on campus or where or would you recommend staying on campus? Just in case to answer both of those, for one, I would recommend staying on campus your first year just to get that campus experience. I stayed on campus my first year and I loved it. I stayed in University Village. No, I did not stay in the suites. I stayed in UV, University Village. For those of you that go to KSU or want to go to KSU, you guys know that KSU has some of the best dorms in Georgia for uh, students who live on campus. Literally, there people who have this thought of college, um, sharing a bunk next to your, your roommate, y'all in the same room at KSU, it's not like that. You get your own room, you get your own bathroom, you got a washer dryer, it's literally like a mini apartment. It is actually kind of pricey though, for people who are looking to save. So if you really just want to stay at home and you have that good relationship with your parents to where you can stay at home, I would highly suggest it. But if you don't, go ahead and come out the pocket because it kind of is worth it. When I say kind of, that's loose, but it is worth it. Next question, I like this question. Top three albums of 2019. Everybody knows at the end of the year, I always make my top 10 albums of the year. Just kidding, I've actually only done that for two years now. But this year, I'm so excited to do it because we've got some good albums in the running so far. But my top three so far, this is in no particular order. I'm definitely going Gunna, Dripper Drown 2, Thug, So Much Fun, and Pierre, Born, Life of Pierre 4. No order. Last question, how are you liking your new apartment? Thank you for asking that as well. I love it. I'm actually doing a full apartment tour. I said after, in my moving video, I said after um, this video that you're seeing right now, the q and I will be doing a full apartment tour of my whole place. And as you guys know, you guys just seen this room. This room is also gonna be a little project that I'm gonna be doing on this channel, just getting this room fully set up for my videos and my production and my music and everything that's got going on. But I do love my apartment so far. I got a full apartment tour coming up. Hmm, when do I have it coming? I don't wanna lie. This weekend, you'll be seeing a full apartment tour. I'm not gonna lie now, you'll be seeing a full apartment tour even though everything's, everything's furnished, everything's good, but it's still not finished. We're still a long shot to be finished with our spot, but I will give you guys a full apartment tour just because I'm kicking back into the vlogs to uh, so you guys will be seeing my crib anyways. That's it, I only got 300 subscribers, so that's all the questions I had. <laughs> And I'm excited to be just back in the swing of things here on YouTube, on the John John Vlogs channel. Thank you guys for rocking with me. Um, you got any other questions? If anybody wants to know anything else about me, leave them in the comments down below. Follow me on Instagram at John John Vlogs. Follow me on Twitter at John John Vlogs underscore. I don't got too much else to say. Subscribe if you want to see more dope videos. I'm signing out and I'm going to see you guys real, real soon.